Hey guys, Terry here. I wanted to do a quick video of some new things I have purchased. Um, first one I'll talk about is this Let's Make Art. Um, a friend introduced me to this and this is my first monthly um, box that's been delivered. Um, in it, I haven't opened it yet. Um, I'll do another video um, unveiling this. It's probably my next video. Um, yeah, the company is called Let's Make Art. And there's a gal who's a uh, water paint artist, and in the kit you get the paints, and the paper, and um, a sketch of something, and then it has a video that you watch on their website that shows you how to um, follow along and learn how to um, watercolor. So I love that idea. So I will be doing that, and I'll, like I said, I'll have an unveiling of that. Next, I've seen these, this new company called Penny Black, and I thought these stamps were just beautiful. This one's a bird. This one is a wreath with some sprigs here, and then some just, just beautiful pine cones and evergreen boughs. So, I thought they were beautiful. And then they have dyes. That are um, I got these ones for this one makes a border and a window in your card and it just makes this indent and then it's got these snowflakes so there's an example there if you can see the um, design that it makes and it cuts out a window so I can't wait to play with that I thought that one was really unique and, oh, it's nice they packaged some cardboard in it to keep them, keep them from having any troubles in the shipping process. So these dies have just a little, just a little loop on the outside. And again, they cut a window. You can use the inside piece or the outside piece. But it's nice because they cut it and the, the, um, little design that it does is on the outside so that way you can use it as a border so I thought those were I thought those two were really unique and I love those stamps so then I also took a trip to um, uh, husband and I took a trip to San Antonio Texas and um, got these bowls at one of the little craft stores and um, I'm hoping I can use them for the um, watercolor painting. I thought they were so pretty. And um, I th I've seen others with the watercoloring have two bowls of water. So I don't know what that is yet, but um, I thought these were just beautiful and uh, really wanted to have them in my craft room. And then when we were in San Antonio, we went to a town called uh, Wembley to see a play. And there was a scrapbook store there, so that was a pleasant surprise. So I bought some uh, Bow Bunny garden paper, had cactuses. I tried to get stuff that I thought was, um, you know, Texas-y. <laughs> this is Jilly Bean, and I just hadn't seen this yet. Jilly Bean's here in town. We live in Columbus, Ohio, and um, I hadn't seen this yet, so this is a cactus and it's got hug me need water free hugs stuff like that don't let the prickly things in life get you down and then it has a coordinating die so I thought that was adorable and then this is dare to be artsy I hear a lot of people talking about this lately um, I don't know if it's a brand new company or just n new to me um, but they've got a lot of unique um, stamps that are just gorgeous. So dare to be artsy. I'll put links in the description to these products. Picket Fence. Love their stamps too. I think I have a couple of their flower stamps now. Just they're known for their large um, flowers. Um, so I usually make an A2 size card but I might have to get into making ones that are more like a 5x7. Um, or this runs off the card a little bit. But I thought that was beautiful. It says love and laughter are forever. Have faith. Choose love and friendship. I love us because of you. So I thought those were beautiful. 
And then I got the obligatory Texas stuff. I got some stamps and uh, for some, I'll scrapbook my pictures that we took on the trip. And then they had this pretty pack of, um, whose, whose paper is this? Simple Stories. And it's uh, baby paper. So I got that for the new grandson. I haven't done a lot of pictures. It's got some adoption stuff on it, which I thought was really unique. He's not adopted. <laughs> um, but I just thought the colors were beautiful. So that's from Simple Stories. So that was my latest haul. And like I said, I think my next video will be um, explaining this uh, watercolor painting uh, monthly kit. I think my next box is already on the way, so I need to start playing with that and using it, and uh, I will catch you guys later. Thanks!